Welcome back. Sorry I didn't have a video last week. Uh, there was some pretty bad weather and I had to work in the middle of the week, which meant a, get a race against sunset. So I couldn't film and do my work at the same time. This week, the order of business is just checking on the queens. Those that were mated and I did buy two. One of them might not have survived. So we'll have a look. Well, first, I'm going to have look, a look at this, uh, this hive. When I moved them here, they were in the process of requeening themselves, probably because the queen was lost in transport. So we either have laying workers or a returned queen. Have a look, shall we? Yeah, there's eggs all over. It looks like they successfully requeened themselves. I feel like you can find the queen. I'd like to mark her. Well, I've never been particularly good at that. Over. Oh, well, I found her. She's right here. Wait. I love those queen catchers. You've got to be d delicate not to decapitate the queen. I've seen that happen a few times. Thankfully, I haven't done it myself. She's a beautiful lady too. Now I need the green pen. Oh, she's right here. Now I'm gonna mark her as delicately as I can. All right. So long as you don't mark the head and antenna, you should be fine. I'll let the paint dry for a minute or two, close the hive back up, and uh, make sure they get extra frames. Okay, let's put her here. Clean aside. Give the extra room. Lower frame in the middle. Perfect. Last step is releasing the queen. There you go, lady. And she's in. Okay. Now let's see how this went. This is empty. There's bees. Now this nuke has a cell, not one of the two queens, so let's see if there's eggs anywhere. I think there's some activity. Right. Now this may take several weeks for the queen to uh, come back mated. Last year I had like, ser like most of them were made it within the first week, but a handful came back after uh, quite a while. No eggs.
the cell emerged. And there's a few emergency cells. Hmm. Well, I'm going to give them a week or two more. If not, I'll just merge them in another hive. Now this one, I don't very don't have very high hopes for. I gave this hive the queen that was rejected in the in the starter finisher, and it's not looking great. There's no activity at all. There's nothing. I don't know, man. This looks like a third dud. Queen cell, let's see if it emerged. Yep, the queen cell emerged. No activity at all. There is some activity on this one. Oops. No eggs. There is very little activity here. What happened here? Queen cell died. The cells chewed on its side. Well, so far it's been really, really bad. It looks okay. But not great. No traces of a queen. But so far, out of the 11, it looks like only two or three succeeded. Let's see the queen cell one looks like. Now these are the last two. This one had the second buck fast queen. This was the starter finisher, which I left one cell in. Let's see if the queen even survived. I'd settle for 50%. At least there's still some activity. That's good. Nothing. I see a few uh, queen cells. Well, at least there's two cells in there, so they have, may have they may have let her lay a few eggs and then got rid of her. This one seems a bit promising, but I see no eggs yet. I'm gonna give them a more uh, more time. Well, all right. That looks like a series of pretty crushing failures. Almost all of them are no go. So, I either graft again, and I'm not set up right now, try to do some uh, walkaway splits, which I could do right now, or buy queens, which I don't really want to do. So what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to try and uh, do some walkaway splits. I'll, I'll find frames of eggs in all the hives, and put them in each and every one of the uh, cells over there. The, the nuke boxes, I mean. So we'll see how that goes next week. Anyway, that's all for now. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Please like and subscribe.